Now, tonight in Medical Rounds, helping aging parents. This is often a difficult topic for adult children to deal with. What do you do if you sense something might not be quite right at home? And where do you turn for help? Here with us now tonight is Nancy Becker from Hartford Healthcare Center for Healthy Aging with some tips and advice on how to care for aging parents. Good evening, Nancy. Nice to have you with us tonight. Good evening. What are some of the signs that uh, may indicate that your aging parent needs a little help? So you want to look for anything that's out of the ordinary. Maybe there's paperwork or bills that are stacking up, mail that's been unopened. Also looking at your parents' appearance. Maybe mom was someone who always had her hair done or dad was somebody who shaved every day and they're not doing those things anymore. Another great place to look is at the car. Are there any dings or dents that you're noticing? All of these are signs that something might be going wrong and it's time to talk with your aging loved one. That's a great, great tips there. Tell us about some of the programs that Hartford HealthCare Senior Services offer offers to provide the help that aging parents may need. Absolutely. So Hartford HealthCare has a lot of services, all aimed at making sure that folks are getting the right care at the right place and in the right time. So if somebody's healthy and active, we want to connect them with the Good Life Fitness Exercise Program or some of the outpatient rehab facilities. And if somebody's needing a little extra help at home, there's in-home caregivers they can get, emergency response systems, and the electronic medical uh, medication dispenser. And if home is actually no longer the best home, Hartford HealthCare also offers assisted living communities and and nursing homes. All right, let's talk about home. I mean, that's that's the prickly point here. It can be difficult, as you well know, to give up your independence. So what can we do for our parents who still want to live on their own at home? Absolutely. This is a really difficult conversation to have with your loved one, but it's so important to talk with them about what are their wishes and to be supportive of their goal to stay home. So making sure that you're offering a listening ear, letting your parents know um, that you want to support them and gathering information to help them stay home. Um, so just let them talk to you about what their goals are and make sure that you have resources that can help them do that. All right, and one last quick question. What about the caregivers, the adult children who are taking care of their mm -hmm. elderly parents? Any advice for them? Absolutely. These adult children are really the caregivers for everyone, and they're the glue that's holding the entire family together. So we need to support them as much as we can. We want to make sure that they're connected with support groups, caregiver series, maybe even going a step further, hiring a geriatric care manager or caregivers in the home that can take some of that burden and workload off of those age, um, adult children. Wow, that's some great information. Thank you so much, Nancy, for sharing your insight with us. You gave people a lot to think about. And they can call 1-877-4-AGING-1 for questions on aging or for a free assessment. In the meantime, perhaps you have a question for Nancy that we did not ask. You can head over to the Hartford Hospital Facebook page where Nancy will be answering your questions in a live discussion beginning right now.